Hey, 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 Laura J. Getting ready for a wedding this day. I am straightening my hair and getting some of the waves out. But I say it will not be fully clear sailing for the sacred question they used to ask to gain entry into sacred societies, which then turned secret and corrupted and polluted it all. But the question that you used to have to be able to answer, to demonstrate your empathy, compassion, your ability to listen and connect and to be able to relate to others and therefore potentially wield power more responsibly, was to answer the question, how do you know when you are suffering? With the answer, I know I am suffering when I see another suffer, for it wouldn't be in the matrix if it was not in me too. Like, everything is patterns. Everything is about patterns. And so when we realize that if we want to straighten out the hair that we share with the world, when we decide to let it be down so it can be free, to roam, or whether it's the path that we are trying to blaze because that's where we need to go and that means others will need to follow later on, but know that it is possible because they knew someone who did it, like you, could be for them as their example. We are the ones that are here to give one another the example. It is not just about the ones who books were wrote about, and believe me, I say that as an author. <laughs> I am proud to say that five years after I thought I would become an author, I became one. <laughs> it took significantly longer for that book to rebirth me and all of the realities I had to maneuver through in order to be able to do it too. So in that process of actually becoming an author, what I realize is the amount of creative liberties extended to the writer of them, which is where we then have to see about how all of these mandates we have been implied to need to follow our BS, belief systems, by a corporation that would need you to believe that you are automatically employed and therefore subjected to being a subject to the corporation who would like to impose their rules onto you at all times, even though you're only accessing that opportunity part-time, casual even. <laughs> like these are the things we have to start seeing. Corporations require us to contract our form, our substance to fit forms. We must conform to be long from, long to and benefit from is what we're promised, right? Well, the insanity is that we have been sold out by our fellow man and woman, not because they meant to, but because they didn't know better and we're just doing what we've always done to get more of what we've always got. War and terror. Isn't that what the war on terrorism is about? To breed more of that which the black magicians know is focused on, so instead of actually resisting anything, we just instead persist in defending and fighting that which we no longer wish to be divided in. And if that is truly the case, why not just shift our focus to frequency now? Why not realize that sound frequencies are the microwaves that are in the airs? And so then we must see that the air of the AIR is also similar to the H-I-E-R-S, heirs, of ones who will inherit that which they have right to, once claimed, because they know who and whose they are and how they're connected. And we are stronger when we stand with good people. When we know who we stand with, when we are able to connect with our parents, the pair of rents that we were issued for this incarnation, which we thought we needed permission from 
before we realized it's permission, yum. <laughs> it can be tasty to fulfill our purpose. It can be wasty to not do it. To not let your heart song out of your heart center because you didn't think you were enough. Well, that would be a shame, and let me tell you, as someone who has been singing my own song, drumming along to my own beat for a long time, I say to you, many do not like me for it, and so don't be offended, yo, when someone cannot deal with all you are and have become because you no longer freely invited those who only wanted to take the you out of your kingdom when you get the thieves out of your house you no longer have to worry about that showing up if you're not stealing from yourself, then you have no need to steal from others who are doing their best to help a friend, a fellow man. It's how we stand stronger to can see the benefit of 2020 vision of where we were when the world was hit by the vex the v been intentionally deployed because it's the ploy used to annoy frustrate or irritate those who have done the inner work and are now stuck with ones who don't give a fuck <laughs> sometimes you just have to go along the easiest path so long as you don't sell at your soul you must leave more hope yes don't be the fool that gets taken for a ride forgetting the fool is one letter different to command but is a whole different beast That's when my friend says we're nearly through her head of hair. Her mane is now more sane. It don't happen often because it takes a long time and not that long. I just haven't had anywhere to go for so long I am so excited to have somewhere to go with good company <laughs> ah,
fun, 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 fun. So, you will see some pictures. That was my song. I wonder what you thought. Did you sing along? Would you if you could? That's the question we must ask ourselves as we come back home to our heart center. Hmm? Follow the stranger path. He's following along where others have went last and say, hey, yo, beware of that. Be aware of that and know that you, in fact, are wonderful, full of wonder. Lord Jay, namaste. Enlighten me honors. Enlighten you. Peace out.